Hi everyone, I am here today to share with you guys my Magnolia March um, event uh, design team project and I am so excited to share this with you guys and also um, if you guys do not follow Nurse Laurel, I recommend you guys go and follow her. She's super sweet. And again, um, I am going to be having a giveaway on my channel. Um, I For the giveaway, I am going to be giving away two Magnolia stamps. And you will not know which ones they are until the day of the giveaway. But I will also be adding, along with that, um, some other goodies, some stickers and other goodies that I have. Um, and I will share all that with y'all before I do the giveaway at the end of the month. And again, for the giveaway, you must be in the US. You must um, like and comment on every single one of my videos that say Magnolia March um, Design Team, uh, DT. And also, I would, you have to be subscribed to me. I would recommend that you go and subscribe to all the other ladies, but that's not going to be um, part of my giveaway, just for the simple fact that I've even been having trouble finding some of the YouTube ladies, um, their YouTube channels, they either don't have any, um, or, you know, uh, they, I think it's ladies and gents, because I think we have one gent um, on the design team. Um, but I haven't been able to find their YouTube uh, channels, and then with the links that Laurel sent me. Um, so yeah. Uh, I do recommend that you go and subscribe to everybody because they all have awesome projects. But anyway, I'm going to share with you guys my project for this week. So, I made a card and I used the Magnolia Tilda stamp, um, the princess. And I used the card that came in the design team package. I also used a unicorn from the greeting farm and it just says, you're awesome. You really can't see it um, right there. It just says, you're awesome. And I used, that is from the Paper Smooches Unicorn stamp set. I also used the bling that she sent around to put around the edge. And I used um, some Distress inks for the background. And I really love the way it turned out. And when you open it up, this is how it comes out. And you can write your sentiment here. And then, of course, the back is super dimensional so that it could um, fit right next to... Um, that little clear pocket there. Um, I really, really had so much fun making this. I used um, some Copics to color her up, and for the hair, I believe I used um, E. Let me zoom in a little bit and see if that we all can see it a little bit better. Um, I used E55, E53, and E57, if I'm not mistaken. That's what I used, and then I went over it with the white gel pen, and then for her skin tone, it was E00, E11, and R20, which are my go-to skin color um, for the Magnolia, for any kind of stamped image. And then for this one over here, I believe I used like R, RV66 maybe, and RV32, um, I don't, I'm not quite sure. I should have wrote all these down, and I am so sorry. My mind is everywhere. But um, yes, go and check out everybody else's design team projects. Also remember to leave a comment in this video for your chance to win two Magnolia stamps and some other goodies that I will be throwing in. Um, and again, like and subscribe if you are not already subscribed. I'd really appreciate it. And yes, I am a bit rusty. This is not my best kind of card at all. I've, I've done several cards before that have been way, way, way better than this, but I have not done a card in over seven like seven months maybe or so i haven't done a card i i think i did one and that was it so yeah just kind of be patient with me as i get back into the swing of things and coloring up you know my images and stuff i haven't really colored anything in that long as well uh, so yeah thank you all so much for sticking around thank you for subscribing and again i hope that you guys are enjoying the magnolia march um event that is going on that Nurse Laurel has put on for all of us and I cannot wait um, to see everybody else's other projects so thank you all so much for watching and I'll talk to y'all later bye bye